Did you know that in Disney World, everyone's supposed to, like, all the employees, from the guy who uh, picks up garbage to the guy who sells you soda, they all uh, are mandated to be as nice as possible. Yeah, they'll get fired. Chipper, otherwise they get fired. I was waiting for my bus just yesterday, and the bellhop was a 65-year-old guy named Herbie. And he goes, uh, he goes, um, because the uh, bus you take to and from the airport is called the Disney Magical Express. And he goes, let me tell you something, Red. He said, (laughs) Glad you're Red. When you... Come from the airport to Disney World. It's the Disney Magical Express. Okay. When you leave Disney World and go back to the airport, it's the Disney Tragical Express. <laughs> what? I don't know what kind of stand-up material he was trying out on me, but for some reason I fell for it and overlaughed at his bad joke, <laughs> at which point he then showed me a picture of his pit bull. <laughs> and he goes, look at my dog. But by the way, I, I do like Uh-oh. how Southern people say dog. I realize I say it very much like a New Jersey, and I say dog. He goes, look at my dog. Dog? He goes, uh, this is a little pit bull. He goes, uh, we had a peeping Tom problem the other day, and, well, I sucked my pit bull on him, my dog, and the guy tried to fight him off, so I pointed my gun at the guy's head and said, leave my dog alone. I think that guy was the peeping Tom. I think that's the problem. I was just like, Herbie, I don't think you're going. You're following the Disney World employee Her- orders. Herbie, you're making Walt Disney feel look bad right this now. Is, you're, you're, this is like 13 infractions. Yeah. This is not chipper. Uh, you could just tell this guy was old enough that he was like, I could give a fuck if I get fired <laughs> by Disney World. Look at me, dog. He'll just go back to robbing pharmacies tomorrow. Yeah, right. <laughs> Herbie. But I'm not complaining. I find him to be highly entertaining. Oh, he's listening. In case Disney World's listening. No, because Disney World has fucking little spies everywhere. Oh. I demand Herbie to keep his job. I like seeing his pit bull, who has eaten apparently three peeping toms <laughs> in his little house in Georgia. He goes, and then he goes on a deep level. He goes, my son, I haven't seen him in a year. Oh he God. finally moves down here. Jesus, Herbie. And then How old is he's only working for two months. He's like, son's like 30, 35. Sure. And he goes, uh, and they transferred him back to Minnesota. <laughs> Broke my goddamn heart. Here's a picture of my other dog, Rocky. Don't you show a picture of your son? He just kept showing pictures of dogs that he had. <laughs> so I, at, at that point, I was like, I'm ready to come back. I'm ready to come back to the Northeast. And then what happens is you get into reality, and you think even like the people at the airport in Orlando are going to be, you know, Disneyfied. No, no. no and they're no. dicks. They're and airport like, workers. Yeah, it's like a terrible job. What hap- they live and in Florida. What happened to the cool vibe? It's it's it really brainwashes you, you know. But I loved it. I enjoyed myself. Yeah, yeah ride the uh, Seven Dwarfs Mine Train. Mm. How was that <laughs> fucking going nuts, <laughs> man? That's kind of hot. Yeah, it was. It was <laughs> sexy as shit. Seven Dwarfs. Right, Roy. That's right. Right, Shafe the Bakey. Huh? Do I have to call you Shafe Floyd from now on? Is that what we got to do? That's baby. Huh? What were you doing that stairwell? Uh, what were you doing? Just hanging out. What were you doing? Were you doing the Sean Barry diet? What? Show pro. <laughs> What's were you show? smoking that weed? Pot. Show pro. Is that what you were doing? Smoking that herb? Not. I don't think you were either. <laughs>